Good morning, modern steaders. It's windy out this morning. Brr. 47 degrees out and that wind is blowing strong. Nice thing with the wind is hopefully it'll help dry out all of our mud. The pigs don't want to come out. They're like, yeah, it's nice and cozy in the IBC tote. They didn't even eat their dinner last night. Good morning. It is one of those brisk, nice, chilly mornings when you don't want to get out of bed. We had our windows open. You can feel that little cool breeze blowing over you and it's like, oh, this is so cozy. I think the pigs were feeling the same thing. I hear you, Hope. And Blossom. Go ahead, get up there. Now they're all three trying to eat on the same side. They're funny. Come on in, Willow and babies. Get in. Oh, you babies sleeping? You look nice and cozy. There you go, Willow. Come on in. You're nice and warm. Come on in. I'll leave you. Little ones to it, staying warm. I look so cozy. Come on, Hope. We're gonna put this out in the hay feeder. Come on. There you go. Come on, and Figaro. What are you doing, Hope? Huh? Good morning. Yeah, it's nice chilly out, isn't it? Big difference from how warm it was yesterday. Morning. I'm gonna leave the back door closed for the baby goats to go outside. It's too windy right now. Maybe it'll warm up later. We'll open it up. Feels like a fall morning. You know, like one of those brisk mornings where you want to get a fire going in the wood stove? Yeah, that's what it feels like this morning. We started putting the electrical conduit in yesterday for the barn. And today they're supposed to be back with some gravel and putting in the road to go down to the barn. I think he's looking for Figaro. He's not looking up high enough. You see him? Let's go to the house, come on. Go ahead, go to the house. These meat birds are loving their water. They're almost drinking five gallons of water every day. I find it a bit comical how they don't try to escape the greenhouse when I leave the door open. Any other animal, they'd be flocking out that door as quick as they could. I had to get my winter hat out. We're getting like 17 mile per hour wind gusts and it's only 40 degrees out this morning. Yesterday it was like high 75, 78. And it's cold this morning. Fill you up with some seaweed. And then we're gonna get some for Willow. You guys nice and warm back here? It is, isn't it? <coughs> There you go, Willow. Have some seaweed. You need that? 
No, it's just seaweed. That's all I got for you. There. Sounds to me like they're here dropping off some gravel. <laughs> we missed the first dump truck. They got it dropped off. guys don't even care if there's all this construction going on behind you.
We gotta put a good solid road in so we can get the dump trucks equipment down here and the concrete trucks down here we need to pull when we're ready to pour the concrete slab. If we didn't put all this ledge pack down first, the cement trucks would get stuck. <laughs> It's looking really nice. I like it. Of course, it's raining out again.
I just landed the drone. It's raining and hailing out right now. Do you recognize your backyard? No. No? I like it though. Wait till tomorrow. Yeah. Oh, the piggies are napping. The piggies are napping. You guys sleepy in this cool weather? You want to let the baby goats out? You wanna come out well out? Give me some chaff hay. What do you think, little pea? Oh, and little man. You got some hay stuck in your mouth, little man? And here comes the little one. Yep. Your kiddo's having fun up there. In your ear? No, like right here. Right here. Did it hit you? Yeah. You decided to come out? Huh? You decided to come out? Oh, what are you doing, crazy white chicken? People think we should name you applesauce because you go with pork chops and applesauce. I see Figaro. So do I, Figaro, don't fall in the hole. And if you do, make sure that you can get out. Wow, Figaro, you're smart. Oh, it looks so nice. Oh, I wonder how many eggs today. These four are nice and clean. Moose, trying to make a video over here, dude. Somebody was in there. Someone was in there playing around. Oh, they hit an egg. Oh, I better double check in here better. Nope, no egg. No egg. We got five, six, huh. They're really holding out on us today. Seven, eight, nine. Tonight for dinner, I'm gonna make some sweet and sour chicken over brown rice with some steamed broccoli and carrots. Oh, it sounds so good already.
to our friends Haley and Wyatt out in Wyoming. I hope you guys didn't get too much snow out there the other day. I'm really getting excited about the barn project. Ugh, the old lane's looking so good now that we got gravel on it. They should be coming back tomorrow, which will be Monday's video. And we're going to be making the pad area leveled and getting it all straightened out. we got to bring in some, some, quite a bit of gravel to get that done. So that'll be tomorrow's project. And then after that, we can get the concrete pad poured and then we can start building the barn. It's going to be so exciting. I can't wait to see what it looks like once it's all done. And then the goats will have a new home. We'll be getting some fence. I have to figure out how we want to lay out the fencing for the goats and it's going to be so many projects going on this summer but they're all fun and exciting. Thanks for coming along on our journey with us guys. You're a huge blessing to us in our homestead. I read a fun quote today by Albert Einstein. Life is like a bicycle. In order to keep your balance, you must keep moving. Man, that is so true. No matter how hard you get knocked down, you got to get back up and keep on trying. Hope you guys have a great day. I'll see you right back here in the next video at Lumna Acres, a guide to modern homesteading, self-sufficiency, and freedom.